Hello and welcome to the battery test of iOS 12.4.1 and a semi-speed test as well. So this time the video is going to be a little bit different. As the battery health on these devices are still the same as they were when I shot 12.4, I'll be using the scores from that test and compare it to 12.4.1. So if you want to see that video, I have a link uh, up in the right corner right now. So as always in the background, I'm setting the brightness level to 25%, checking that auto brightness has been disabled and then running the test. So let's speed that up a little bit and let's get back when we start the battery test. So we're ready to go, all we need to do now is power off and I'll be powering off right now.
So now we're back, all the devices are now charged again. So let's go in and before we check the scores of the Geekbench test, let's just verify the battery health on all these devices. And as you know, it's not possible to get the battery health from the 5S, so I used a special tool that I've linked in the video description down below. So now let's launch Geekbench and review the scores. So battery-wise, iOS 12.4.1 looks to perform best on iPhone 7 and 8, getting 9 and 6 more minutes of battery life on iOS 12.4.1. iPhone 6 gets 3 more minutes, while iPhone 5 drops by a minute, and iPhone 6s drops by 4 minutes. Not really sure that you can conclude that iOS 12.4.1 is better on battery life, but for sure it's not worse than what we saw on iOS 12.4. So that's it for the battery test, now let's just run Geekbench uh, CPU test and also the HTML5 test and compare to the scores of the 12.4 video. Those were the results of iOS 12.4.1. So now again comparing those results to the video that I did earlier of iOS 12.4. So as you will notice the iPhone 5s, 6, 6s and 7 are all scoring higher in the Antutu HTML5 test. For some reason iPhone 8 is not. When it comes to Geekbench CPU scores are a bit all over the board, but common for all of them are that the difference in the scores are very small. You can see by the green check marks where the highest scores are at. So that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching and please subscribe to the channel and like the video. People who do that I know have faster iPhones with longer battery life. Thank you.